The truth of Tesla robot Hinnail destroy humans, an open letter warning that artificial intelligence AI could one day wipe out humans was signed by hundreds of prominent figures in the field. The one-sentence declaration stated, alongside other societal scale risks like pandemics and nuclear war, mitigating the risk of extinction from AI should be a global priority. The letter was the most recent in a string of concerning but notably vague warnings on artificial intelligence. AI systems of today are unable to wipe off humankind. A few of them hardly know how to add and subtract. Then why is the greatest AL knowledge base so concerned? The terrifying situation. Companies, governments, or independent researchers may one day be able to use strong artificial intelligence AI systems to manage anything from commerce to warfare, according to the tech industry's Cassandras. These systems have the potential to achieve things that we would like. Furthermore, they were able to withstand human interference or even multiply themselves to continue functioning. Professor and University of Montreal artificial intelligence researcher Yashua Bengio stated, Today's systems are not even close to posing an existential risk. But after a year, two or five, too much is unclear. That's the problem. We don't know if this won't go to a disastrous point at some point. Frequent users of a basic metaphor are the anxious. They claim that if you instruct a machine to produce an infinite number of paperclips, it might go crazy and turn everything, including people, into paperclip factories. What connection does that have to the actual world or future world that is imagined to exist soon? Businesses might give artificial intelligence, AI, systems an increasing amount of autonomy and link them to critical infrastructure, such as stock exchanges, power grids, and military weapons. They might then start to produce issues. This did not appear very likely to many experts until the past year or so when businesses such as Open, AI showed off notable advancements in their technology that demonstrated what might be achievable if artificial intelligence develops at this rapid rate. Decision-making and thinking from current humans and human-run institutions could be usurped by artificial intelligence, AI, as it becomes more autonomous, stated Anthony Ed Ware, a cosmologist at the University of California, Santa Cruz, and founder of the Future of Life Institute, the group behind one of two open letters. The great machine that is governing society and the economy is not really under human control, nor is it something that can be turned off any more than the S&P 500 could be shut down, he predicted at some point. That is the theory, anyway. Some AI specialists think the idea is absurd. Using the word hypothetical to describe existential risk is a nice way to put it, stated Oren Enzioni, the founding CEO of the Seattle-based research lab Allen Institute for AI. Exist any clues that AI could accomplish this? Not exactly. However, scientists are turning chat GPT and other chatbots into systems that can act on the text they produce. The most notable example is a project named AutoGPT. Giving the system objectives like found a company or make some money is the idea. Once that is done, it will continue to search for methods to accomplish it, especially if it is linked to other online services. Computer programs can be generated by a system similar to AutoGT. It is capable of running those programs if researchers grant it access to a computer server. Theoretically, AutoGT can accomplish nearly anything on the internet with this ability. It can access databases, run programs, build new apps, and even enhance itself. Systems such as AutoGT are currently not functioning effectively. They frequently become mired in never-ending cycles. One system was given all the tools it required by researchers so that it could duplicate itself. It was unable to succeed. Eventually, those restrictions might be removed. Conjecture's founder, Connor Leahy, stated that people are actively attempting to create self-improving systems to harmonize artificial intelligence, AI, with human values. At the moment, this isn't functional, but it will eventually, and we're not sure when that day will come. According to Mr. Leahy, when researchers, businesses, and criminals give these systems objectives like make some money, they run the risk of infiltrating financial institutions, igniting a revolution in a nation where they control oil futures or reproducing themselves if someone tries to switch them off. Where do AI systems pick up bad behavior? Neural networks, mathematical systems that can acquire new skills by analyzing data are the foundation of artificial intelligence, AI, systems like ChatGPT. In 2018, businesses such as Google and Open, AI started developing neural networks that acquired knowledge from vast volumes of digitized content extracted from the internet. These systems learned to produce writing on their own, including news stories, poems, computer programs, and even human-like conversation by identifying patterns in all this data. Chatbots like ChatGPT are the outcome. These systems also show surprising behavior since they are learning from larger amounts of data than even their designers could appreciate. It was recently demonstrated by researchers that one system could hire a human online to get past a CAPTCHA. 
The system misrepresented itself as a person with a visual impairment when the human asked if it was a robot. Stub experts are concerned that these systems may pick up more negative tendencies as researchers train them on ever larger volumes of data and increase their capability. Prominent figures in the industry and science, including Elon Musk, have also issued new concerns about the dangers. The most recent letter was signed by DeepMind co-founder Demis Hassabis and Open. AI CEO Sam Altman. Hassabis currently leads a new artificial intelligence lab that brings together the best researchers from both DeepMind and Google. So this is the end of our today's video. Do you like it? Kindly give your valuable response in our comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more interesting and informative videos.